Yes, sir. Damn. Let's get the whole 19. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Back at it again. Episode 20. Wow. Episode 20, man. So if you look behind us right now, uh, it looks like we've been we've been robbed, but we haven't. Uh, we're we're getting a better location. All right. So uh, you should see that they took the speakers behind us, and if you you can't see in front of us, but like they're we're packing up right now. We will be in a little new location uh, next month. So until then, we gonna stay here until until we look like Will Smith. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> when you know the last episode when it, you know when they we decided to move. So. We going to keep it like <laughs> Nah, I mean In the middle of the you, mean, you know what I'm talking about In the middle of the living room Yeah, that's how, that's how we going to be Until, I mean, we, we, we're we good Alright, but uh, welcome to the stool I'm DJ DC uh, Got L, L, L Yo, yo, what's good, everybody? What's up, man? How you feeling? I'm cool, man Chillin', chillin' Alright, anything popping this weekend? Anything you get into? Nah, man, it was a kind of light weekend Nothing major for me Okay Nothing major that's what's up, man. Chef! Yes, sir. What's happening with you? Man, not much, not much, man. We chilling, we chilling. You right. know, 360 Arts awesome Production, man. We got to shoot a couple videos, you know what I'm saying, over the weeks, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. that's what had been occupied, you know what I'm saying? Got to do a little, a few little tricks. Okay. Been, been waiting to do, you know what I'm saying, on some music videos. So That's what's up, yeah, that's man. Been, that's been what we've been on, man. It's always working, man. Nick, what's happening, bro? Oh, he ain't got a mic. Oh, we can hear you. Good, chilling. He doing the same thing. They work on the same thing, man. They, they, they brothers. We out here working. Man. That's what's up, man. So we supposed to have like a special guest. Yes, sir. Come through today. So who is she, man? So this is new. So this is like a surprise guest. Yeah. Kinda. So, um, she basically hit us up in the DMs. You know what I'm saying? Which we urge all y'all to do. You uh-huh. know what I'm saying? Like the Stew Podcast 757 on IG. You know? Yeah. And, and she said she want to come up here and, and do what? She said she's an interesting person. So we're about to see how interesting she is. All right. Let me see. Is her name? Does she? What's her name? Um, I want to say it is. It is. It, it, it's actually it's. Jade, Jada Rain, Jada Rain, yeah. Jada Rain. You know, that sounds like a stripper right? name. Hey, uh. Do you think she's she a stripper? <laughs> well, I mean, you can't judge a book by its cover, but okay. What's her? What's her Instagram? That's I've that's her Instagram. I've seen a couple pages. That's her Instagram. Yeah. All right, let me see. And you look her up, man. It's Jade Rain. Okay. Oh, throat. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's for y'all that that have. Oh, oh, she's calling. Hold on, let me see. Her cam- here. Hold on. Say say what? Is it? Sorry, uh, is it on the side? Yeah, yeah. Come come to the side. Okay. All right, we coming. All right, so we got a, a special guest. She's here. All right. All right, so... Um, let's hit the applause. This, the this is the applause girl. button, so Nick's going to let her in. We got to make some room for her, man. Jada Rain. Jada Rain. Jada so, Rain. So, this is what we're going to do, man. We're going we gonna to make some room for the guest. Oh, man. Special Bro, guest. I don't... So, she just wants to come up here? That's it? Check. That's all she wanted? She's going to be interesting. Okay. That's what we're promised. Y'all hear this mic? I can hear you perfectly, bro. So Jada Rain, let me see her. So this was the. Uh, let me see her, run, her rundown. Guy. Yeah. So pretty much, she says, "I'm an escort, but I'm a female male advocate." What the hell does that mean? Oh, I, we got questions. We got questions. I'm opening an all male massage parlor for men only with. All women workers. Good. Hold up, man. There you go. Where's she at, man? Come on now. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Where's she at? All right, so it's... uh. 
Miss Rain. We're gonna call her Miss Rain. That's Ms. cool. Rain. I'm gonna ask her if that's cool. Where's she at, man? She waiting for somebody. Oh God. How many people she got with her? Okay. All right, so I don't know, man. This is this sounds real interesting, man. What you got going on? <laughs> yeah. Hey, man, we got to find out, man. Shit, I don't know. <laughs> me, man. Welcome to the stew, man. You never know what's going to happen. Episode 20, man. If y'all haven't already, man, subscribe to the YouTube, all that, man. All right, so what's uh, what's coming up, man? Valentine's Day is coming up. I got to ask for, for Miss Rain for that, man, because I'm pretty sure she has some Valentine's Day specials. <laughs> More money out the pocket. Oh, man. Oh, there right. she is. What, hello, what's Special up, guys. y'all? How you doing? How you doing? How Special you doing? guest is here. All right. Fine, all right. Fine. Have a seat. Welcome to the stew. Welcome. Thank you. All right. Okay. Uh, how you doing? Well, welcome to the to the stew. You mind introducing yourself? Let everybody know who you are. Well, hey, you got to talk in the mic, girl. Okay. You got to talk in the mic. I'm Jada Rain. All right. Born and raised in Hampton, Virginia. Some may know me. Some may. Not okay. Nice. Y'all gonna know me after this, though. All right, <laughs> that's what's up. Okay, okay. Yeah. So, uh, uh, well, so tell us what you got going on in the city. Uh, I heard you got a, a massage parlor. Things you're working on. Yes. Uh huh. I am about to be a licensed massage parlor. Um, like mm-hmm. I told, I don't know who I spoke with exactly, but I'm a male advocate. I love men. Okay. Um, yeah. Well, so, what does that mean? So that that's what it means. You love men. A male advocate. No, I mean, well, uh, you don't necessarily see females say they're a male advocate. Okay. You know what I mean? Like, a lot of females don't understand a male's perspective. Okay. Or where y'all come from. Oh, you know what I mean? Okay. So, yeah. I do because I'm an adult entertainer also. Okay. So... Jada Rain. Okay. Yeah. See, it makes it. I told you. So, you. So you. I told you. Right. Then I tell you, okay, I knew I was tripping. Right. Okay. Right. I won't. Okay. I won't. My bad. I wait, ain't know. Wait, wait, wait. What you say? No, no, I no, no. Yeah, no. It, it, the name sounds like it sounds like a porn star name. Yeah. Jada Rain. Yeah. So that's why I was like, okay, I get it. The, he was on the money. I was on some shit like, eh, you, you know, don't know, you man. Know. You don't know. I was you gave me the benefit of the doubt. I was fucking wrong. I mean, we were just you shooting our shot. I like yeah. that. I like that. But yes, I am um, aspiring porn star. I ain't made it yet. Okay. You know, but hopefully, you know, somebody see me because I am doing what I need to do to get my name out there. That's why I reached out to you guys. Okay. Um, it starts from home. So, so as far as the uh, location, uh, it's going to be in, in Hampton. No. Okay. No. So I don't. I no longer live here. I live in Florida, Jacksonville, okay. Florida. Oh, okay, okay. Um, but I want to move back to Houston. That's where I want to start everything. I feel like a lot of businesses that go to Houston they flourish. Yeah. Um. So that's where I want to that's go ahead so. and start my business. But I, I will say I have done some business out here. Also, I have a major clientele out here. So. Okay. Well, doing what? Massage. A massager. <clears throat> Okay. Yeah. So what comes with sensual massages? Yeah. Sensual massages. So that's what. So, so what comes? This is booming in VA. So, <laughs> so what is up with it? So what is a so what is a sensual massage? Explain that to people who, who may not know. Sensual massage is when you massage private part. Oh, okay. Yeah. And so, <laughs> is, so is there is there? I mean, you have you that. have the option to have a happy ending or or not, but you know, some people just like to be massaged their entire body. Okay, so is there like a? Is no rule to that? Like, like if you sign up for it, then you you. What you mean as far as rule? Like, do I have like limits? Yeah. Uh, yes, of course. Um, okay. It's all in the session that you book. So if you book a sensual massage, then that's what you get. Just a massage. So you, so else. so chef, what you mean? It's it's a thing out here. What do you mean by that? Obviously, she said business is good. She got a few Very clients good. out here. You, it's that let you know. Niggas is getting the, the the happy endings. A sensual side doesn't mean that you're going to get a happy ending. You I mean, to, I'm saying, you, well, you have the opportunity. Yeah, you do. You know okay. So, Majority of the time you are, the men are getting a happy ending because that's what they're into. Yeah, okay. that's what like, they're booking. That's like, I don't like know too touched. many niggas, that's, especially a single. Believe nigga. it or not, they, they're not even single. Well, it's a lot of it's a lot of I tried to take up for Yeah, y'all it's a lot of okay. it's a lot of taken men that likes to be touched only because they got a lot of things at home that they they aren't being taken care of. Oh, okay, so you so you taking care of them since since the the, the wife's ain't taking care of them at home. It. Yeah. Damn. 
So, ladies, y'all better step y'all game up, man. <laughs> I'm not this trying folks to steal here. man, though. That's the thing. Start, I got yeah, my own. Just, y'all better start <laughs> learning something. I got just own. providing a service. I'm, I'm just providing a so, service. So, I'm strictly business. So, that's your man? That's your man? Yes. So, so th- they, he knows that you're doing this? Yeah. Are y'all like, y'all like. We are porn. not. Because of me, I be in my own head. We are uh-huh. not an item item. Oh. Because uh-huh. I'm still doing happy endings. If you get what I'm saying, I hey y'all some na- hey y'all some nasty motherfuckers. Hey bro, can we can we get a mic, mic please, bro? Oh, man. No, I gotta ask some me. questions, he's man. So so y'all so so okay so let's let's get into it. All he right, respects, so he respects my hustle. Yeah, okay, so are y'all That's so so we all um you're a go entertainer. So uh do y'all y'all use each other uh as uh for for. I don't put him in. So it's that. like I mean, open. I mean, you didn't gotta put him. The table. Yeah, you know, I I understand. So I was open with, with him. y'all. That's, that's I was open. As if y'all peep my page, I'm open with everything. I don't want mm-hmm. nobody to try and blast me or put my own business out there. So mm-hmm. that's why I'm open with everything that I do. I was open with him. I gave him the option to want to fuck with me or not. Yeah, you know what I mean. Okay. Outside of this, I'm I'm a woman. Outside Damn. of what I do. Okay. Gotta hit the applause button for that, man. That was a, <laughs> we gonna have to make a reel out of that one. <laughs> so okay, that's what it is. But as far as business goes, he respects that. Dang, bro, I just can't see myself doing that, bro. I don't Why know. Not? I don't know, man. I couldn't. I, I mean, I know there are some people who are into that though. They like to watch their uh, their girl get banged. He's never watched me do that. You never watched it? Never watched it before? No, I wouldn't allow it. Okay. I don't put him in my in my. I mean, what if one of your videos like go viral though? You know what I'm saying yeah. he happened to just you know scroll and then hold up. He's probably gonna be like, "That's my babe." <laughs> That's cool, but he, I mean, he's seen it then. I mean, come on. So, bro, you didn't mean to tell me you never seen her do it before at all? You never watched it. Well, that's not what you do, though, right? You, you, Mm-mm. you're a massage therapist. But she says she's no. She right? says she's a session. She's a. She wants to be a porn star, bro. Inspiring. Mm-hmm. Inspiring. Yeah, it I'm big. not there. Yeah, it yet. ain't like. But you got to start it's somewhere. All right. These exactly. Like, it's all over the world. <laughs> but she got to start God, somewhere. Damn. <laughs> I do have to start somewhere. So it's essentially, true. if I mean, you get that break, your man's ain't tripping. You know. What I'm saying? No. That's what you're saying. Right. I got. I got damn. I get it. I mean, because you got to Come on now, eventually. Come on now. No, eventually. No, eventually, no, no, because eventually he's going to see it somewhere. No, I mean, if you're trying to get to that level, he's going to end up seeing somewhere. But that's, I mean, like, it, but, it's, but, but that's you got to understand it. Yeah, see, that's what I'm saying. Like, he, uh, yeah, he obviously a, understands. Yeah, he understands that, yeah. There's potential for that. So, like, I'm not really. That can't be the thing that breaks. man. Us. That right. can't, what do you mean? Right. It, can't, what do you, it could. Can't be the only thing. Bro, it because could, I see. But, but basically, what I, I take from it is you know what I'm saying? y'all, you laid everything on the table, so y'all already knew everything. I'm assuming you know everything about him, like right. he know everything about you. Right. Y'all laid it all on the table before right. going in. And calling exactly. it, and bro. like you said, it's not even a officiated. We're not, com- we not committed. But he he respects what you but do. We not committed. You feel right. me? He can do whatever he want to do. I don't want to hear about it. I'm doing what I'm doing. I don't tell him about my endeavors with these other men. You know what I mean? I know that's cr- that's crazy though, but it's, you just never know. Like the, how the internet is, you may be scrolling. He may start his own thing. You know what I'm saying? And that's cool. And no, he I'm no, 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 no. I'm saying no. I'm saying he may start his own thing, and then you just I mean both of y'all boom, and then happens. And, Y'all got people sending y'all stuff. Damn, your girl going crazy over here. Let me. Y'all gotta have fans see, that's gonna be looking for is, you, and they're we, gonna show. We talk outside of the camera. He knows that's cool. anything that I'm doing first. But the thing is, so check it out. Say if I don't know, man. Say if she, he don't watch it, then he happens to watch it. Damn, like damn, babe, babe, going. You didn't do that to me. Definitely do it. <laughs> he did it. He did that to me. Go a little harder. You go a little harder on him than me. I mean, but and I'm but money is business. I know, but. Hey yo, you that's never know. Some might come out of you, man. You, you might have been. You, I mean, yourself, if if honestly, I'm gonna ask y'all if a female that she was rocking with, because we knew each other before I got into all of this. Yeah, I was in the corporate world. We was working together, or whatever. That's cool. We show interest to each other. Yeah. Then I left, started my own thing, and I realized like, yeah, I really want. I want to pursue you. He want to pursue me. Okay. But it's me that's saying no. I don't want. Us to be committed yeah. while I am still, you know, mm-hmm. full fledged doing it. Yeah. If I feel like I ain't going, this ain't going nowhere, mm-hmm. then I'm going back corporate. We can 
Okay. You know what I mean? Because he has a he has a mother, he has a family, and all of that. Yeah. So I don't want him or anything what he got going on to be hindered because of what I got going on. And I think as a nigga, I think that makes you uh, that makes you have a little bit even more. Not even say a little bit, but that has you has more respect for somebody that's like, well, shit. Look, I ain't. I can't even be with you on that level mm-hmm. until I'm. Um, you know, I'm I'm out of this, or I ain't doing right. this, or while I'm in this, I just, you know right. what I'm saying? I ain't even trying to play with you like that because I know what this is. Right. And mm-hmm. I know how committed I am to this. Exactly. So I, like, that alone is is commendable as fuck. Now, if you know I make it saying? big, as, he's just you know going to have to tell his family, hey, look, this is what it is. <laughs> you know what I mean? If I make it big, Oh, so, that's so, so do you know, does your family know? No. Y'all families don't know? My family know. His uh-huh. family does not. Wow. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't even want to. Why not? But my mouth too crazy. So y'all, y'all families don't, don't, you think they're going to judge you? For sure. You think so? Yeah. That's what families do. I mean, yeah, that's, that's, that's that's what any family. They going to judge you regardless. Especially mom dudes. Think so. His son? Yeah. (laughs) That's, that's the thing you got to think about too, man. (laughs) You think about it like you got kids and then, you know, the internet is out there and all of a sudden they friends get a hold of that video of mommy. It's over. Going crazy. And then, then, bro, I'm ready to shoot somebody over my mama now. (laughs) You ever think about that? I think about it all the time. I mean, I don't want kids right now. The the, the world is too crazy. All of this going on and it's just too much going on to bring a child into this world and then I'm doing what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. I have enough respect for myself and... My guy. That's what's up, man. Like you say, you don't, you, you don't know what you got to do. Yeah, I'm about to say, you sound like you got like, it Like, no bullshit. Like, you just you don't hear that enough. Because nine times and out of you ten. you got enough respect you see, for yourself to keep but, that, like, private. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, you know, why are you still pursuing it? It's a, Bro. Right. I get it. Because I, I was just about to make a line the other day. Come on. You know what I'm saying? About how, you know what I mean? Like, you click on a shorty reel that do got, you know, that is a stripper. Or yeah. that mm-hmm. do got a OnlyFans that really be trying to be on it. The very next clip is her with her kid. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, that, I, I'm about to say, times is kind of new up. now, I too. Always, I mean, it's just... It's, I, and, I, and it's you, no, it's no not. But it's just weird for that, seeing though. it in the same three-minute span reel of, like, you was just, like... I don't know. That shit weird. I mean, am I the only one that feel that way? Like, I think it's no, just... No, you no, you're not. It's a little bit, like, what you expect people I'm, that's mm-hmm. watching your shit to... You know what I mean? Like, you ain't got no type of... Like, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a daddy's girl at the end of the day. And my father passed away. May he rest in peace. So, mm-hmm. I honestly wholeheartedly right, believe if he was still here, I wouldn't be doing this. Because mm-hmm. I'm a father. I'm a daddy's girl. So, but... At one point, I was just like, fuck it. I make more money doing this. You think about it, a person making, what, $25 an hour? Is it worth it, though? Well, yeah. I think so. Yeah. I learned a lot. Mm. Not even just about men, but about myself. Mm. Um, Somebody once told me, your passion will lead to your purpose. Right? Mm. And I I, I love sex. I'm not going to lie. I'm an info. I love sex. Mm. And... Or just anything sexual, being touched. I love that. My my love language is physical touch. Mm-hmm. So I found out, like, okay, let me let me tap into it. I just tapped into the world, and it led me to my purpose. I'm mm-hmm. gonna do psychology. Okay. So this is what I'm leading to. Now I I want to do the massage business, but that's just something I want to get into. It's not something I'm gonna stay in. Right. Yeah. So okay. it's like you're gonna use that means to an end, right. to stepping stone to get right. to. Like what's what next? You really want. That's like, their hustle. Next? That's your hustle. You know, some people. A lot of people. Some don't people get like a brick. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Some people get a, a pack. You know, exactly. there's different ways. Of and hustle, I didn't try so that. I, I didn't try that. That, you know? that. You know what I mean? The street stuff. It's not for me. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm in trouble now. That's why I'm here. So oh, <laughs> that's why I'm in Virginia. Mm-hmm. So I can't. I'm. I'm not. That's what I'm not trying to tap into. I'm trying okay. to tap into, tap into something that's legit. And okay. Adult industry massage therapy is legit. Sex sells everything. Okay, so yeah, that shit ain't stopped selling yet. <laughs> yeah, <it's all> right. <laughs> when that stops selling, you yeah. What what what's next? That's always my question though. What's next? So so I see that uh, your invited says L.A. Fashion Week. So you so you yes, I am. So I've seen a lot of girls with this man. I hope it's not a scam, man. So is no, it it's official? Not. It's official. Okay, so tell I me about it. Um. 
it's really a, a, a platform. I've never done a runway modeling ever in my life. I'm mm-hmm. nervous as hell. Okay. I'm going to bust my ass in front of all them people. Mm-hmm. But I did my research. You had, uh, um, um, what's, the, what's, the, what's the woman? What's the woman that's on TV? Housewives. One mm-hmm. of the housewives did the show. That's how I knew it was official. Mm-hmm. Um, one of the girls from Big Lex Body Collection. I'm trying to get on that too. Um, so, she was on. She did that. So you got to pay anything, or you did? They just yes. You have to. You have to uh, purchase tickets. Well, you have to sell tickets. I bought mm-hmm. mine because. So once you buy, it, then what? Then then what? You're you're. They're gonna. F- you pay for everything. They give you the platform. That's it. Okay. Just a walk. They assign okay. you once you um sell sell your tickets. They assign you a, um a designer. Yeah. And then it goes from there. Okay. But everything else, it to me, I feel like in order to get yourself out there, you got to spend money. Yeah. A lot of people think it's stuff is supposed to be given, especially for the fact that I'm not a model. Yeah. You know that's not what I do. So. No, so you dabbing in everything, man. You got the massage. You got the. Uh, you got the. Uh, you know the modeling. Yeah. So so, what do you really want to do though? Like, what is your main goal? I'm you a jack of all trades. We I'm just a jack of all trades. So what's so my end game is to be a psychologist. That's what. Okay. My, that's where my heart is. Okay. I love picking people's brains. I love a good intellectual conversation. How are you in school? How were you in school? What do you mean? How am I in school? How were you in school? You 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 you're a straight A student or, or no? Bare minimum. I'm not gonna lie. Okay. Now college, yeah. Because I'm going to put my best foot forward, mm-hmm. straight A's. Okay. I'm going to think of what my mom always told me. Like, if you get a D, you don't give a damn. If you get an F, you don't give a fuck. If you get a C, you don't really care. Mm. Damn. Hmm. If you get a B, like then what? Damn. If you get a B, then what? Take that. Yeah. If you get a B, then what? Write that on your refrigerator at home. <laughs> if, you get a, if you get a B, then what? A B is, is acceptable. You could have got an A. You me, you, me, you could have got better. <laughs> I like that. She ain't never got that far. She just, told me, she just told me A's and B's is is, is what you want to sh- you know strive for. Hey, um, all right, I'm off your ass. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I'm off your ass. I like that. You know what I'm saying that's that's some shit my mama would have done. My mom was. It's rough. Boy. Yeah, zero tolerance. My mom had a zero tolerance, but I'm not gonna lie, I didn't put my best foot forward when I was in um, high school. Mm-hmm. Um, I did technical. What school you went to? Kickatan. Kickatan. Okay. Yeah, Warrior. Okay. Shout out Kickatan. <laughs> Shout out Kickatan. For sure, definitely. All four years. So is that that's like uptown, right? No, that, uh, that's from the outside. That's, that's downtown, Hampton, baby. New that's Hampton. Well. That's Hampton. Okay. Fox Hill. Okay. <laughs> Shout no. out to Hampton. Fox Hill, definitely. Uh, it, it ain't about nothing. It's right next to close to. <laughs> it ain't about nothing. It, was it, really, it really ain't though. about nothing. Shout um, out Fox Hill. <laughs> it ain't about nothing. <laughs> um, you know, you got your your fakesters, but it's right next to Phoebus. Okay. It's close, close in that area. Um, you know what I love to do? I would love to call one of your clients, man. <laughs> can, we, can we make that happen? <laughs> Can we call one of the clients? We got some questions, man. Oh, man. I want to call one of your clients. That's hilarious. Man. I didn't expect that. I want to call one of your clients, man, and, and maybe one that really supports you, man. Okay. You got any, you got any white clients? I do. We can't call them. <laughs> Let me call them. I don't want to mess up your money now. Never that. Okay. Um, let's see. I want to talk to It's Black History Month, so. Right? Why do you oh, want yeah, to talk yeah. to the white man? I, I gotta ask some questions See if you know Some black history And let him hey, I wanna yo, ask him Black history trivia I'm gonna ask him bro <laughs> ask, him, hey, ask, yeah, him, yeah. ask him three Black yeah, questions ask white man Why not black history. <laughs> Oh my god Okay so hold on I wanna ask him Let me call him <laughs> Oh my word Just, Yeah Please Please <laughs> Season three To be determined <laughs> we'll see. Oh, man. You gotta want to see, man. I want to see what they got to say. Oh my god. Hey George. Um. So I'm at a podcast, right? What's up, George? <laughs> <laughs> he said, "Hey." Um. And they wanted me to call one of my clients, and I, the first person I thought about was you. <laughs> Hold on. I put you on speaker. Hold on. I want you to connect to this. Connect to the Bluetooth. Okay. It's, it should say road. Um, 
Oh, yeah, go ahead. This is insane. I can't believe I'm doing this. Road. Hey, man. I hear you. Um, our- <laughs> hey, George. What's up, George? I heart guest or I heart? No, hit cook up to the road. Oh, okay. oh shit. Oh, you probably got a whole Bluetooth. Bluetooth. Oh, I damn, there, like, go. Yeah. there we go. Hey, George, hit me, George. Hey, it's connected. Yeah. Hey, George. Yeah. Hey, there he is. We got George on line, y'all. Hey, what's up, George? Hey, everybody. What's going on? Hey, what's going on, man? Welcome to the Stu Podcast. All right, George, man. We got a very special guest in the building today. Uh, she goes by the name of Rain. We call her Miss Rain up here. <laughs> All right. All right, so uh, all right, so Miss Rain is 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 interested in opening a massage parlor. Okay. All right, Absolutely. she's 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 getting her things together right now. She says she gives the best massages out here in the city, and uh, she mm-hmm. wants to know if you will be her premium customer. She wants to know. Oh, I'm pretty much already there as you stand. So absolutely. That's what's up, man. Miss Rain. Hey, look, you got customers out here, Miss Rain. I like that, man. Mm-hmm. All right, so. So George, uh-huh. you know uh, it's February first. Yeah, you know what happens in February first this whole month? African American Heritage. Who? Black History Month. I know that's right, George. That's what I'm talking mm-hmm. about, George. Hey, look, George. That's all I need to know. That's all I needed to know, George. We appreciate you, George. And don't forget that parlor is opening. And now tell me, George. What's up? Absolutely. About to All right. So, so is there like, um, so is there a limit to, uh, uh, well, you know, Miss Rain, she's she's an inspiring porn star, so she's trying yeah. to she's trying to, uh, you know, get her things right so she can take the next step. So, as uh-huh. far as the services uh, for Miss Rain, what do you think she can do better? Ooh, good job. What do you think she can do better? That's a good question. It's a great question. That's a very difficult question. Yeah, I'm very about to say you question. sound a little stumped. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm sitting there thinking. Um, George's like, well, huh. shit. Exactly. Plus, you're going to put me on the spot, and I have to answer for my. I have to answer for my answer next time I see this beautiful woman. You did. I, no, I no. And she wants to be the best <laughs> she can be, so she wants to know these answers. I mean, it's, it's only right. No, like, if you're, uh, yeah, you're providing service. You want to know what you can do better to serve you, right, Miss Rain? Yes. Absolutely. Okay. Um, honestly, right now, so far, every time we've, we've hooked up and we've had a good time, we've laughed, we've talked, we've mm-hmm. enjoyed each other's company. Mm-hmm. Um, the girl needs to get more sleep. You need more sleep. So she said, she so, so you, more sleep, cause sometimes so you are I'm giving out sleepy through and she, and she'll be like, oh, da, 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 and we'll be doing our thing. And all of a sudden I look over and this girl had got her eyes closed. Oh, man. Closed. oh, oh man. man. One time I got to do a little gentle snore. I know. He, he, he's, 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 so hold on. She, she, so pretty much he said you need more sleep. Sometimes you fall That's asleep right. in it. You, you fall asleep with a D in your throat. <laughs> yeah, no, definitely not in the throat. No, okay. Definitely not that. Oh, not in the throat. Oh, but you, okay, it. you fall asleep. <laughs> and she like, has to kind of tap you like, yo, wake up. Well, you know, the, girl work, the girl works really hard. And we yeah, work yeah. really hard together. So, you know, I mean, come on. Yeah, yeah, it's all so good. I, I figured that if we're both wiped out by the end, then yeah. we, we, we both did it right. George, you're right. You're George. absolutely right, George. <laughs> Hey George, maybe if, pre- he can get up and, if he can get up and walk out of the bed, then I didn't do my job. If I can get up wow. and walk out of the bed, she didn't do her job. You're right. So pretty much, he needs to be weak at the knees after he's done. He he, he shouldn't be able to walk after. His legs need oh, to be her wobbly. Legs do, her her legs do have a beautiful little shimmer to them when you, when you get her. Yeah. Oh, you say your legs got a little shimmer. They oh, got okay. a nice little shimmer to them when when after she uh. Giggles more than a few times. Oh, after you giggle, after you giggle a couple of times, you get your legs get a little mm-hmm. shimmer. That's, yeah, what, that's what George shimmer. says. Yeah, yeah, George. Appreciate you, George. George, she says she'll see you tomorrow. George, I. Oh, yep. I look forward to seeing her tomorrow. All right, George. Appreciate your call. Give it up for George, y'all. George. <laughs> Giving those great reviews. He, he didn't have any complaints. Hey, yo, this is crazy as hell. 
You just need more sleep because <laughs> you work night. too hard. This is crazy, man. He comes see me Basically. at night. That's the thing. This is wild, yo. <laughs> he definitely gave a lot. This is wild as hell. Compliments. I heard that. <laughs> That's what's up, man. You know, it, you got to be perfect. Nobody perfect. Um, That's wild. I will say that I'm not perfect. Um, That's what's up, Miss Rain. I do good, good service though. <clears throat> That's what's up. <laughs> Hey, what service? <laughs> <laughs> Ms. Rain is in the building. Hey, Ms. Rain, we appreciate you, man. Anything else you want to say to the folks out here? Um, Like, follow, and share my page at It's Jada Rain mm-hmm. on Instagram. I'm not on any other social media because I got banned. Um, Look, why don't you start only? You have OnlyFans? Yes, I have OnlyFans. Bro, I mean, y'all could be making money together. What are y'all doing? You know that, right? I want to include Bro, y'all my can... papa in that. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying though, you know, he, he don't have to be in it. I'm just saying though, I've been, I've been thinking about it a lot though. I'm like, man, why? Ain't like they gotta see me. Ain't like they gotta see me. <laughs> you know, I do got like a little I'm mole right here. I'm real territorial, so okay. I just, I, I, I mm-mm. because you got females that do it too, and then they be like, who you collabing with, and then. <laughs> I, I gotta be like, God damn! I gotta share my 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 nigga. Uh huh. You know I mean? Okay. Like I'm no, I'm good on. Why that. not? He's sharing you. Okay. <laughs> That's wow. Like, kind of crazy. It is. You, you crazy. he can share you, but you you don't want to share him. But he, he can't make money. Before, like this is what well, I did. Well, she, I thought you said you just don't want to find out about it. Hold hmm. on. No, she said she know everything that nigga doing. <laughs> Off the rip. This is we interesting, man. Yeah, that's yeah, a yeah. Like, it ain't no, I want to know. No finding out what. It we both no. know, but it's just. I was into this before we was to like actually talking, talking. You mm-hmm. feel me? Now, if he was into it, then cool. I have to accept that. But he's not into this lifestyle. You feel me? Okay, so okay, okay. I gotcha. couldn't see myself doing this type of stuff with him, and then it takes off. And then. Cause he got a family. He got a okay. whole. I got family. you. Got you. Got you. Got you. Got you. Right. I could. I just couldn't see okay. myself doing that. I got you, man. Uh uh-uh. We got you. <laughs> she said, "I'm not sharing." That's, 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 that's just what it comes down to. That's that's. Hey, women ain't sharing, man. No, definitely not. But just it definitely I, I is would, cuffing season too. Valentine. Well, how y'all y'all got any Valentine's plans? We definitely do. I don't want to spoil no surprises, but I kind of snapped on him because he's he a laid back, he a laid back, chill kind of guy. Uh-huh. I'm a Virgo, so I expect a lot of things out of yeah. You know what I mean? So expectations always kill me. Yeah. But he just want to make sure that I'm I'm pleased. So I don't snap. Gotcha. But um, I got faith in him. That's what's up, man. What's what you call Papa Bear? I call him Papa. Papa, we see you out there, Papa, man. Hold it down. <laughs> yeah. That's so, what's up, man. Y'all just follow me on Instagram, and y'all see. I'm not releasing the name of my massage parlor just yet because it's not um, up and running. Exactly. Gotcha. I haven't, haven't patented it yet, so a lot of motherfuckers are still that. But I will say this it is mm-hmm. only for men and men only. Sorry, ladies. I love y'all, but it's only for men. Word up, man. That's what's up. Miss Rain, we appreciate you stopping by the stew. Thank you. Thank you for having me. No problem. Thank you. All. You're more than welcome any other time. Applause. Yes, sir. All right. No problem, Miss Miss Rain. Shout out to Papa. All right, y'all. So that was our very special guest for the day. Now, of course, we're gonna be talking about some you good. You go, you go ahead and walk. Go ahead and walk through. Appreciate y'all. No problem. Yeah. You want to walk him out, Nick? We appreciate safe. you, man. All right, folks. Right, that'll be easy, one. man. I thought I was your security guard. Pop a big ass dude, bro. <laughs> I had to oh, ask man. the question, bro. Pop a big, hey, man. <laughs> you know, you know, like the Nick. You know the the baby security guard. Yeah, oh, yeah. he's like oh. a he's like a dark skin. I think he played in. Um, he like he's like, a, he's like a he's like a he looks like a yeah, center. No, I think he in um the uh, GTA um RP. Oh, like oh, I think uh, he was one of the niggas with uh, T Grizzly and shit in the game. Oh, that's what's up. Yeah, bro, he looks uh, he looks like about, a, uh, he, the baby bodyguard. And they could call. Yeah, he was making the comparison. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he the dude. Papa Boy, looks Papa like Papa. he looks like a he could play. He could be a center in the league. Hmm. All right. <laughs> Got the pop in, uh, Miss Rain. What the hell was that? <laughs> Where, where's the? 
What the? <laughs> hey, yo. Miss Rain, we see you out here, man. Be safe. Yeah, what's wrong with it? Definitely yo. be safe, man, because it is wild out here, Miss Rain. George okay. sounded pleased. Yeah, bro. <laughs> I don't know, Papa, a good one, bro. I couldn't do it, bro. I cannot do it. I'm telling, I cannot do it. <laughs> After he said that, more sleep line. This nigga said, well, "I may have the answer for my answer the next time I see this young lady." Like, oh. Hey, yo. Anyway, man. Hey, look. Like we say, you're more than welcome to come on the stool. We up here just oh, kicking shit, shit, man. That was funny. And no, uh, you, was, you was right, Briggs, uh, Chef. That that joint definitely was interesting. <laughs> I told you. I have never encountered this Chef like got that. special Me guest. <laughs> and she was a good guest. Like she actually answered all the questions. Yeah, she was better than my other girls, though, for sure. What is? I ain't gonna lie to you, man. Cause yeah, so that's like the opposite of a feminist, but she's a yeah. female, right? <laughs> I, like, like, that's crazy. She's saying I understand <laughs> men and I. She like fuck woman king. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. That's Yo. hilarious. No women allowed. <laughs> <laughs> In my parlor. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Sorry, ladies. Hey, chill out, man. Oh man. Oh man. All good. right, so. Oh, man. <laughs> All right, so you know today is is um, oh, well, the Super Bowl is is official, y'all. So do y'all think it's gonna be a cakewalk for the Eagles, man? For the Eagles? For the Eagles? Yeah. You think they win it? Hold on, get Nick's mic. Get Nick's mic. So, oh Lord, here we go. We got Nick. This is a setup. You think it's a setup? The Kelseys are playing each other. Uh, Kelseys are playing each other. It's the Reed Bowl. Yeah. Andy Reed, old team, new team. So do we really, really? I'm going to just go ahead and address the elephant elephant in the room. Oh, Lord. Here we go. What's up? Do we really, really <laughs> consider this a Super Bowl between two black quarterbacks? No. no. Yes. It's what do you mean? Patrick Mahomes is black, man. What do no, you mean? Bro, we are claiming him, bro. No, we're not. Yes, we <laughs> are. We're claiming him, bro. Bro, we, bro, it's, it, bro listen. He is a white All, boy. You know how many. Close your eyes. Listen. And listen to him talk. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Like, yeah, super okay. black dad. Oh, say what? Yeah, say, where he Tiger, up Tiger Woods sounds the same way. No, he but don't. his dad's black. Yes, he do. Nice, really. Tiger. Yes. Nah. He sounds like claim- a nigga that tried bro. to sound like a white guy. Bro, there's no it's way. It's a little bit different. He sound like because a he, sounds- he sounds like a. No. Tiger sounds like a nigga with a white man trying to talk proper for white people. Patrick Mahomes sounds like a white guy trying to put Bro, on a nigga voice. Just because I'm he sorry. sounds white don't mean... I'm sorry. I, is there a certain way you have to talk to be white? Well, all of them talk the same. So, I mean, maybe. Damn. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Where am I? Where's the Bro, bomb at? Where's the guy right? What am I saying? Then they can say the same thing about us. <laughs> yes, it's a certain type of way that you talk as a black man. I'm sorry. If you close what? your eyes, if you close your eyes... Tell me one white man that sound like a black dude when they talk. Uh, like I, straight up. Tell okay. Him, tell him, and, and tell okay. him to say a white word. Tell okay. Him, okay. Don't, don't, don't cheat it neither. So what do you okay. say? Tell okay. him to say a white word. Melanin exudes okay. through the vocal cords. Okay. So what about. Possibly. <laughs> so t- keep it on it. it. <laughs> it's some soul in it. So what about the guy who talked for Cleveland Brown? You know he was white. When Bro. you hear Cleveland. Did you think of Chevy racist man? Somebody impersonating. <laughs> Let him talk his regular voice. That's, That's racist. What I'm talking about. But when you hear Let him Cleveland talk his regular you voice, sound like a white guy impersonating it, a black person. It does. Yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to check. Yeah, it sounds I, like that. I kind of get what you're saying though, because it's like a certain element a certain of soul. And so keep okay, okay. So you say so. Keep it a hundred. Did you know "Color Me Bad" was? I don't so- know who that is. <laughs> exactly. Did you know they were you saying? Heard the song, you heard the song. I'm about to play it. Okay. Cause you know, okay. Did you would you think Robin Thicke thought, was white? Who Robin Thicke? Would you think he was white? Yes. Hearing his voice, definitely. Cap. No, you Why? wouldn't. <laughs> First of all, I already seen him, so it it, it kind of destroys that. Like just like we talked about before. Okay. When somebody already when you already see it's, it, it already yeah, destroys. You seen I think, it already, so you you know where it comes from. And when he, it's when different he came now. Out, if I didn't see it and didn't hurt him, it's a possibility, maybe, but no. Robin Thicke, not even close. And another thing about him too, he's not he even, was a well known actor's close. son. So I think that's right. what kind of killed it. So because he's half white and he's not part of the culture in a sense, that makes him go with the white side. I think Bro, that's, yeah. that's kind of fair, right? Yeah, 
Yeah. Bro, he Not is. You gotta pick a culture, you know what I'm saying? But bro, think about it, bro. Like Post Malone sound white. I don't care what song he sing. I'm just saying, bro. No matter how many times you say Iverson, there's no way. Like sound white. <laughs> I'm just ah, saying. White it's, Iverson. Like, like, that, like, I'm, I'm not. I, I wouldn't even say. I mean, he yes, he does sound like himself. He sounds like himself. He but he what I'm saying is, all I'm saying is, is it's something with the vocal. Co- I don't know, man. Bro, I you. And, I'm and telling I'm you. Say, where's your headphones? You got headphones. All, I'm not gonna say all singing because sometimes there is. Songs. You said soulful. Yeah, but when you talk, I'm talking about how we talk though. For one, that's how I started. All right, let's 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 backtrack because there are certain artists that do mimic very well, and they have made their singing voice that way. Mm-hmm. I mean, shit, Mark mm-hmm. Morrison. You have headphones. Like let he him hear black. this. Singing, but when no, talk, so tell me, he ain't sound. So like tell me, no did did you know? <laughs> you wouldn't have known. Okay, exactly. That's what I mean Man, by soul. Tell them to talk on an interview. That's all I'm saying, DC. So you Elder Barge. So well, that's that right there is adapting to what they hear. They hear somebody sound kind of cool, kind of. Oh, let me do my black voice. That's all that is. Let me do my cool voice. Tell me I'm lying, bro. Tell me I'm lying. Thank you. Uh, we we, we Thank no, you. no, we talk. You listen, listen, Thank listen. You. No, no, but, but listen. They putting black voice on, man. They putting their hip hop voice on. They putting their swag on. It. That's all they doing. We we, we went over this before about they the Chinese restaurant. We, we talked about this about the Chinese restaurant. When you order a Chinese, you kind of have that little Are voice to add on to it. Yeah, ten minutes. Yeah, you, you know. yeah, I know, I know. We do it consciously. Why don't? So they, so you think so you think Patrick Mahomes is, is that's not his voice. Or you think it is for real? I think when he actually, talks, he sounds like a white guy. He talks like a white guy when he talks. But y'all see this dude that look like he could be black. He's half black. But, but okay, keep it on it, bro. Black. I ain't gonna do him like that. Yeah. He's half black. His dad is super black. You know, I was very surprised to see his. So you mean so, so you he, like close your eyes and just listen to him talk in an interview, bro? So have you seen anybody? Have you seen? Have, I know you've seen it before. Uh, a group of white guys and one black dude, and he sounds. White as a motherfucker. So how, why do you think Patrick Mahomes wasn't raised around a whole bunch of white people, too? He still but he's still black. White. He ain't no nigga. Because he talks white? Because he ain't no nigga. It's mixed. He's you mixed. You ain't around niggas. You ain't, you ain't no nigga. He's mixed. <laughs> what are you talking about? He's mixed. You can't grow up around nothing but white people and say that you a nigga. I'm sorry. You not Because he hangs out with white people, so you're not where, a nigga. Where, what? Where? Where's your nigga at? You know, his, his dad, you're not, his dad you're is not black. black around me. His dad is black. You not black around me. His dad you're is black. black. <laughs> you not black. His dad is black. So what? Doja Cat be in that same category? That's the stronger. Uh, so she, Doja she Cat be makes? around niggas? Because I don't think no niggas would let her walk around as crazy as she goddamn walking around unless she getting paid with, through them rituals and shit. She that's what she looked like. She looked like she's stuck in half of them rituals. <laughs> be that red shit that she was wearing. I know y'all, man. Oh my god, that shit looked like somebody threw blood on the. It looked like part of the um movie when um it's a new movie that came out. It's like a part of a ritual where they threw blood on the chick, and she was wearing that dress. Doja oh, Cat. Man. She already done shaved her eyebrows off and looking crazy, putting on. Man. Yeah, that girl crazy, man. That's what I'm saying. Like, well, you consider her like she's having half like what's her name? And that girl who right? Doja. Uh huh. If she what, what, is her dad or her mom white? I mean, yeah, which I mean, one? Same situation. The same dad is black. Man. I think so. She black. Technically, she black, bro. That's just that's that's yeah. the she's black, bro. Yeah. We gotta claim her. We claim her too. So we gotta, we gotta claim. claim, claim we gotta claim her. Father's black. She black. So we gotta claim. We gotta claim Pat Mahomes, man. And we claim yeah, Bruno, Bruno Mars too. I'm not claiming them just because you say it. No, what is Bruno Mars? Bruno Mars is black. It ain't no black in him. He's like Cuban or something. Nah, he is black. No, he ain't got no black. Bruno Mars is black too. Nah, he ain't got black parents, bro. Nah, I seen that. I need some. I need some. That's why I don't like him. What? Because I think he's a culture vulture. 
so bro, much. Bro, he's an amazing artist, bro. This bro has hits. He makes hits. He, 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 he makes like timeless. From the 70s. Yeah. Yeah. Timeless you, classic. Thomas it kills him. Sonic Mars. Care. He don't care that, about That the, was dope. What they bro. Do. They <laughs> but he also had help. Uh, what I was the other dude? That was all Anderson Pop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Without Anderson Pop, all his music is... Rip off from from no. the seventies with great writers, bro. This all rip off from the seventies. But you know how hard it is to get those samples clear, though. Obviously, this the the, the on, original on, people, on, on, the on, people on, rock on. with I know it. You're not judging his artistry off of what he can get clear. <laughs> yes, I know they, just they, they hear it and they say, "Yo, this is a hit." This is some bullshit. And people know, know what hits are. See. DC, I know they, they, he they makes still, hits. DC, they still make acts. They still make people. That's still a thing. That's still a thing, bro. Still, they see bro, this, this little, niggas. this little so guy, he has new no looking person in him, and he's singing these. Like, think about it. He's Michael not black. Jackson he looks black. He got the curly and... hair. He can sing. Twenty four karat magic. That's something good to market. Yes. He can go both ways. See? Hmm? I mean, he can't be mad bro, at the marketing. No, no, I don't know, man. Why, can't look, you, why are you mad at the marketing? Look, look what they made. Look what because they did on your boy. Because he gets stuff that artist that's better than him will never get a chance well, to get. I don't know if it can go both ways. Whose fault is that? That's the other people. That's their fault. Remember Lil Nas Not X being in the right place in the time. country. No, it's because he's not black. But right? I, that's what I'm saying. No he, black artist is just gonna jump on the scene and get three, four number one hits to start their career off in yeah, the pop they, culture. They, they so, sure okay, so songs. Songs. okay, okay, yeah, okay, what about Lizzo? Not in the pop culture. So what do we say about Lizzo then? What? Well, she plays she's a violinist or something, right? She's black and she's in the pop world. She pretty much doing the same thing Bruno doing. Yeah, but she actually yes. plays an instrument. Like she As Bruno? Did. Yes, uh, absolutely. He grasping for straws, y'all. What? He grasping for straws. L- bro, Lizzo is huge, bro. Especially He's huge. Yeah. 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 No, go ahead. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> hey, go ahead, bro. <laughs> you the one that laughed. No, I, see, no, bro. I She's amazing, bro. I would, bro. She's you selling out arenas. Okay. They, they, I, I watched what? her. I watched her John HB, uh, HBO. He was about to say HBC. I, I was. So do you? <laughs> bro, HBC. Did you watch it? Did you see it? Uh uh-uh. uh. But you don't think, bro? Bruno Mars is I'm telling you, watch that bit? and then let me know how yes. you feel. Just a tad bit. You, uh, you feel don't like, feel like because he look, is? At, look at this. They stopped. Now I as, feel you. As with much Lizzo. as I don't cool. like to uh, talk about this kid, they stopped. Well, they didn't stop him, but he had to adjust his song and add somebody to officiate it because he was trying to top uh, break into the country shit with that old town road shit. Remember that. Take my horse to the Old Town Road. Song. I bet you if that was Bruno Mars, Remember they would have let country, it happen. The country world, they was like, "Fuck no!" Like, yeah, yeah. They and they had to, and he had to throw Gar, oh, whatever the Cyrus, dude name, yeah, the Cyrus nigga, the Cyrus, uh, yeah. yeah. That was the only way to consider Billy Ray it Cyrus. the country yeah. song. Because at first they so, was, because they they, he would have been blatantly culture vulture. Yeah, yeah. Because they wouldn't consider it a country song. So I think, yeah, to a degree, I just feel like I just feel like the urban culture we give that shit so much of a pass because. From the start, our we always, culture. Yeah, that's the only that's culture that gets yeah. to do it. Okay. Ours, black but look, culture. in that's order for let, it, let it, it be anybody else, any other race, any other thing, yeah. they call that shit the fuck out. But you know, there's always been that's a, all I'm saying. A, a, a duality with our culture mm-hmm. and people being attached to that in order to further our shit, and then we take the shorter end of the stick. You Every know, that's time. always been mm-hmm. the since yeah. the yeah. since the you know since after the forty, well before then. Look yeah. at the muddy water story. All them, all them old dogs that that our parents listened to, man. A lot of them ain't got shit. Scraped. Sliding the uh, family silk stone or some shit. That nigga was living in his van for it's years because celebrities knew it's still it. Happening. They, they knew where he lived at. It's still it's happening. Invented. It's just people make more say, money. It's, it's more, more money just being now made. Got his pay. Think about it. it. Old boy just even um talked about it. He was just talking about how he um signed the Gucci in for a hundred thousand and went dead broke. Yeah. That, um, that is weird. Uh, now you think about it. Yeah, no, that's, that's, that's what I mean. Like, that is how? weird. They said how? They even said, how you go dead broke? He was like, bro, five lawyers. I got, I, I, yeah. I got five felonies. Um, five first some class felonies that I'm fighting. That's ha- all, all my for the lawyer fees. Yeah. And you talking about a nigga that ain't never had nothing? You talking about after that? I looking at about thirty thousand dollars. A nigga that ain't never had nothing. Mm. That's gone in a year. Damn. And he straight said that shit like straight face and all. You could see it on his face. Like, well, he's. Not bullshit. And you you, you got to think, bro. They're going to take somebody that they know that's a problem or that's somebody that's in debt or in a hole already. It's more profitable for them. So if your dad ain't black, if you already in a you hole. You ain't black. Bro. <laughs> I don't care what y'all saying. We are claiming you Patrick Mahomes. Some, some, your mama got to have something to feel that. We are claiming Patrick Mahomes. If his dad is black, then he black. Nah. <laughs> Two black quarterbacks in the Super Bowl. Who y'all got? 
black the black oh, yeah, one. Don't say the black is the black one. one. Ah. The only black one. You got the black one. I think I, I'm going. I'm going. I'm going with Philly because you know I'm a Raider fan. And he did all that just to not go. Bro, to I'm white still. Man. I mean, bro, he's still good, bro. He's still good. He did all he's, bro, that. He he's still a, he, bro, oh, he's still a great. Bro, he's still. Bro, he's still a great quarterback, bro. Proven he's a great quarterback. He's still a great. That's like the next. Like Tom Brady's gone, bro. That's who we have right now. Yes. Man, we got Lamar. I'm talking about winners, I mean, people who's Lamar. winning that has Lamar. the championships, we bro. Got we got Lamar. He ain't got no championships. So what? Yo. <laughs> uh, yeah. No. Patrick Mahomes is he's the, a he, goat yes, career bro. Right now. This, he's bro, he is the, the Brady right now, bro. He's the GOAT right now. Five Brady's straight. gone. GOAT? Yeah, man. No. He is, bro. He's like a yeah. GOAT career. Yeah. Five bro. straight. Yeah. AFC championship like, come on, bro. With two Trust me, bro. I've seen, I've three. seen this dude three. every time, bro. And it's about to be four. Yeah, this is the fourth Super Bowl appearance. I'm a Raider fan, dog. Yeah, we have like to go Maybe against this third. dude, yo. Maybe it's his third. Every but time I see him play, at least twice. Yeah, I watch the whole game. <sighs> bro is a magician. He's he's like, oh, and Andy that's Reed. what I'm saying. We are claiming that black he man. Black, I'll say that he got flavor yes. with his game. They ain't gonna stop. He, that we are claiming that black man with his game. So I can Patrick Mahomes, shine black man, but this don't beat my Raiders. <laughs> That's all I want. Keyshawn Black, man. Yeah, you see the black in his game. It's like history, Mike, y'all. He watching up, but black folks play the game. I bet you see some nigga in him. We claiming him, bro. A whole bunch yeah. of black in him. You're not even going to claim him for Black History Month, bro. We are. It's Black History Month. We're claiming it's Black History Month, man. <laughs> you got to get. Now y'all, now y'all just picking up anything because it's Black History Patrick Month. Well, we got to, man. Ask for Black History Month. Uh, all right, so <laughs> don't forget, y'all, the, the, the Grammys are going down this week. So we're going to have a, a whole oh, pretty much Grammy show, and then we're going to, you know, base Grammy our special. opinion and stuff. And it's crazy how we talk about the categories and stuff, like the country song you were talking about, uh, the Old Town Road, man. And I don't know. Before, when Uzi first started Lil Uzi, I would have put him in the rock and roll category. Like, right. the, what's the category Prince yeah. was in? What, what category would he be in? He would be in rock, right? Pop. 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 Yeah, popular rock. I would put I would have put Uzi in that like when he first started. When he first yeah. started? Yeah. Which yeah, with that project. rave shit. The rave shit. Yeah. When it, when Uzi first started, when he a had a mohawk and all too, that. Like, and trippy red. That was after though. Because his first shit was that um, hip hop. That uh Imagine perfect, if they were in the pop love shit. That won't even categories. It was they after don't want that. that, man. They will crush. But the white kids are listening to that shit. What? It's almost like how my New York Giants Triple don't want to. Oh yeah, if they had their own face. category. Be no, I'm saying if they was in pop category or the correct category for their music, not hip hop, because that nah, shit ain't that shit should be hip hop, rock, category, black rock, man. or whatever the fuck y'all want to call rock. it. Rock, it's real. There's rock, a lot of people that ain't being in certain categories. Category, category, yeah, that black rock star shit. Rock, it was waves a lot of should definitely be considered country. That nigga music sound like country when music. Playboy Cardi had started that Ride wave, wave and, and, oh, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Like everybody <laughs> yeah, had their own little spin on it. Trippy Red. Spy, like I forgot. I don't never know the names of his songs, but he writes some of his shit. Do be or at least inspirational. Like it sound like country Ride music. Wave. Ride wave. Yeah, it sound like it straight sounds like, like country music. Brian. That's what country music is. Half of it. Oh shit! Yeah. I done heard. They do wine. They wine a lot. They wine, they wine. but they wine to get something to some beer. Yeah. <laughs> it'd be for real like it'd be really that that music to really just drink like let me just fucking fuck you bitch i'm going to the bar Damn. like no bullshit <laughs> Damn. Like, my mind, though, like the mood of the music it'd be so you, you sad was, you was listening to that north carolina country so music <laughs> no nah, man nigga i done listen to all that shit bro you gotta think i look i worked in a in the goddamn oh, yeah, they kitchen, bro. They, yeah. you know, them old head chefs. All they listen to is country, and it be the niggas making me mad as a bitch talking about some Tennessee whiskey. Uh, that don't have you stupid. I don't like whiskey. Oh man, I like whiskey. <laughs> all right, not man. Tennessee, Maybe Carl. I drink anything. Well, not everything. Man, that Jack Daniels. Uh, no, no, that Jack different. I'm on, I'm on the, the second shelf and up yeah. type. Time, I'm a Remy man. Martin kind of guy. Like Green that bottle. Oh shit. Green bottle me. <laughs> All right, man. Like I said, the Grammys are coming up uh this week and definitely we're gonna be talking about it. Now, speaking of music, Chef. Yo. Talk to us, man. What's popping out here in these streets? 
Oh, yeah, 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 you know. <laughs> New music. Oh, Seven prepared, uh, baby. No, nah, um, it's a lot of singles drop, man. I've been trying yeah. to find some albums. I did um run across somebody drop, uh, your boy, Lil Yachty. Lil Yachty, Lil Yachty dropped the, the album. Wall, Whole album. The <laughs> polar. It's funny that we was just talking about <laughs> Bro. They snap when that come on, bro. Everybody got a whole lane. Everybody has a lane, man. What what category would you put Yachty in for for a Grammy? Pop. Pop. Yeah, that's I don't pop. I bought the what? Nah. Melodic. They, do they have a melodic category? Colt T. They have a they have a yeah, melodic know, category. That they should have melodic. <laughs> if he's in it, he got to be like third in a melodic shit. Mm. He would come. to be pop. White people listen to him. They just don't want to put him against the white folks where he belong. Yeah. They be making that type I mean, of music. I just like. I just think that the, it's crazy how pop is. Pop, needs pop to be is. Broken. Y'all put it. It's se- everything's separated, bro. Yeah. Is a white people is pop. That's hip hop R and B is is black people. Like pop need to be broken down or urban to me. Urban because that ain't fair. Because how the fuck white people even get into hip hop then? That's, that's what my I'm problem. saying. Yeah, that's, that's why I feel I like Bruno Mars is yeah. in. I get what you're saying. That's, that's why I'm like, that's what, that's what I feel exactly what you're saying. Because I don't understand how that's fair. Because we, it's hard fair. for like, you our taking hip hop to break and pop, into them, the those thing. genres. It's the same thing, but you're splitting it as black like, and white. Lil Nas S was the closest same sounds. black yeah. kid we had. So now, if you're doing that, if you're splitting it, if this is the same thing, if this is pop, that's that's all it is, pop. Y'all just split it down to half and said, here's hip hop and here's and here's pop. And white folks is pop, and we gonna make them the biggest artists here. And hip hop, y'all got that. But then y'all let slowly let white folks infiltrate hip hop, which I don't understand because y'all won't let us infiltrate pop. R and B with Justin, what's you know what name? I'm saying? Like the white just boys. being fair. all the white singers when it comes to music. Yeah. Like they ain't able fuck? to top both charts. Be on both charts, hip hop, R and B, and just like with the country, NBM, like you pointed out earlier. Pop. Like how hard was it for him to? He yeah, had to in get order a for them to accept of that a country song, person they had to get a country just for it to be considered it. a country genre. That's crazy. Mm-hmm. But nothing changed. No beat changed. No, mm-hmm. no, no, no verse. guitar note changed. See what I'm saying? But we more loose and lax, daisical. Why? Because we don't own shit in that neither. All them white folks that's goddamn A and R's and Jewish motherfuckers that they hate you talking. So about. look, are you gonna watch the Grammys? No, you know I'm not. Okay. I was just gonna say, man, we should all go get dinner and watch the Grammys, man. I'll watch it. What is it coming on? <laughs> is this weekend? I don't or we know. could do the Super Bowl or something. We need a pod outing. Yeah, okay, I'm okay. down with that. I mean, Take a pod outing. If y'all right? hit me up. Go, go get some but steaks. Other than that, I ain't watching. <laughs> that. Get some steaks. Other than that, I ain't watching. That. What else you got, show? Shit don't be on my radar. Um. Yeah, but um, back to the um, got um, the Yachty shit. I mm-hmm. did want to say that um, I was listening to a few tracks. This is about three of them. It's funny that we talking about that because it sounds like the Beatles. Mm-hmm. If he tried to emulate like the Beatles type of feel, the first three songs did it. Like I don't know how else to explain <laughs> those songs. So it's just like, yo, check it out. If you ain't, you know, I, I don't know the name. I can't remember the name of it. It is. Let me see. Um, so would you? Is let's the start considered here. pop. I don't know what I think. I think maybe. they. I think yeah. they kind of coined they, that they like term. Started pop it right. Culture. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think they did coin that term. Pop uh, culture. The Beatles. The Beatles. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. Okay. If we're wrong, let us know in the comments. We don't mind being wrong. Love learning. Yeah, I'm always wrong. So shit. Drop it in the comments. Yeah. Um. Estg. Um. It's a lot of singles. I said. Uh. Blow up. Was one of his uh, singles. I haven't listened to it yet, but somebody told me it was fire, so I figured I, you know, what I mean, throw it out there to tell everybody to check out. You know what I'm saying? Um, how y'all feeling about ESTG G year? Y'all think he did a decent? I don't know. I just don't think his promo was there, man. Yeah, I feel like I, think he, I still don't know what really... he looks like. Damn. It's hard. He looks like I mean, it's hard to damn. say who he looked like. He looked like man. a fucking linebacker. Like he. What, I'm not what, what, interested. No, he, he, saying, like, he played football. Yeah, that's though, right? what I'm saying. Like, what he looked like. I would have seen him. Yeah, I know, you know what you're saying. Like, I was agreeing like, with what DC was saying. Yeah, like, me yeah, too. Yeah, like, like I'm well, like, I feel like right. I feel like Big Glow, man. It's Big Glow season. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, Big Glow yeah. overshadowed a lot of activity, yeah. man. Yeah, she did. for that camp. Yeah, you got to think. She she cashing she cashing yeah, in that, right now. It's always the it's always the songs that are just fun, man. Before that was. You was, know, that's he all did. you heard. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. 
Cause he had the whole little summer like yeah yeah, yeah yeah he had a mixtape with everybody up there and she's the one who stood out of everybody yeah and then Damn. and that mixtape really you know and then it was like um, it what's, was what's, what's Gotti uh what's people's people they, fuck with Boogie too CMG though. CMG yeah. they they you know, they kind of took ain't? over the summer a little bit yeah they too. taking over for sure yeah I mean, they they, that, yeah, they on their Cash Money records uh, joint kind of did yeah and then after that shit him and what's the name got into remember they put out an album. That was I mean not I mean you know Yo Gotti don't fuck with what's the name? Uh Bert Bert what's that bread gang nigga? What's his name? Moneybag Yo. Oh they he not fucking with him now? over the, the new artist. Finesse two time. I guess what's the name went around him and signed him. Oh. When, you know he was oh, originally he signed, signed to money bag. money bag. But see, I knew that so that deal was flaky to, anyway because now he's signed. You, to this dude name? one week dissing you, yep. saying you bit my bit my style, and which he did. He did. And then th- your answer to that was to sign him, which it seemed like a boss move. That's on some to me. That was like a carry, but he took the opportunity. But he probably wanted to get close to Yo yep. Gotti, and Yo Gotti, he probably went to him. And I mean, I don't know. I can't speculate, but I if, can. If that's the case, that's what happened. he definitely <laughs> went over his head. And, and that's because I mean, that's what they said. You know what I'm saying? That's why they got into. So the how whole, is this? Uh, so they beefing over this. I mean, what's the name? Don't fuck with Gotti and them no more. I mean, you know. Money bag, y'all don't fuck with Gotti like Didn't that. Then they no just more. dropped that song, that weak ass song, uh, <laughs> with Big Glow and uh, look, I keep. But you got to think, Money Bag, you know? yo. Yeah, that song was terrible. And you know that shit, the verse, the, the music probably, video is hard. I only listened to it because Glow was on. I'm not a Glow fan, but I just, you sound like I it. like her wave right now, Damn, man. Glow boy, it's good to go <laughs> hear the Big radio glow. And, and hear a chick not talking about you know. Yeah, all, all super sexual all the time because I, I, I feel like, like that's the, all they had. Like, mm. <laughs> voice. I can't do yeah. the voice. Like, I'd rather listen to annoying ass young Miami and them, the city girls, you know what I'm saying, than mm-hmm. her. Yeah, now her talking is a different story. But, uh, and, and she be saying some crazy stuff. Like, I think she said something about doodle stains in the drawers at one time. I don't really get into that. I mean, she young. That's yeah. all. I'm going to just leave it at that. I don't know. Like, but the art, I, I, I appreciate it. I don't know. That's what's up, man. Appreciate your show. Yeah, man. You already know, man. And another um, Anderson Pack featuring on the song, man, with uh, Two Tens. Um, two Tens is the name of it. Corday. Okay. Oh, yeah, 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 that's oh, they got okay. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's just hard. That's the, yeah. that's the one I meant to throw out there. I that's meant hard. to say that last week. But... That's, that's what's up, man. You already know, man. There it is, y'all. Another episode of the Stew. Man, L, you got to tell us some some artists to check out weekly, locally. I man, know, man. You know, L, you man. be working right, with everybody, right? Well, uh, a, a little, little bit, but I've been. Kind of- I want to bring them up here so we can chop them, get in there and see if they talking about. See if they really serious. I do want to give a shout out. Um, shout out to my boy Boop. Uh, he from Uptown. He actually locked down. Uh, mm. I don't know if y'all familiar with Tr, but that was a rap clip, an old rap clip from. Way back from Uptown Newport News, but DJ TR, I'm, I'm currently working with him. Uh, no, TR is a, I mean Thug Relations. Oh, okay, but I'm working with Book. He was one of the members there. He locked down, but we working. He coming out with a um, project that we working on. Um, I'm not sure the name of it yet, and he's trying to get some podcasts going to, going on, but I'm not sure how that's gonna work out. With him being incarcerated, but yeah. But uh, he shout out to him, man, because that's who I'm currently working with. Say, how the hell but, you about to get on the but, podcast? <laughs> I'm not sure, but he called from jail, man. But well, my, shit, yeah, if he got the phone in there, he get the video shit with the type of man. Yeah. yeah. But uh as far as I've been working with a couple, you know, a couple regular clients and stuff like that. But uh it's just been I've been keeping it light because I'm opening up this new place, which should be open by the end of this month. So we okay, still, big things, yeah, big yeah, things. Sir, get a that. round of applause yeah, for that, right. man. Hey, who well, know we make it have that uh Maybe I'll have everything up and running. You can have, watch the Grammys there next week. Yeah, that'd be hard. We can do that. Yeah. 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 That's what's, that's what's up. up, man. Hey, look, man. Episode 20. 20. Gosh, yeah. my, we appreciate y'all, man. Don't forget, like, subscribe, uh, share it to everybody, man. We want to get more folks up here. And shout out to, uh, <laughs> uh, what's it? Uh, Rain. Miss Rain. Jada Rain. What's her name? Miss Rain? Jada Rain. Miss Jada Rain. Ms. I call it Miss Rain. Shout out Miss Rain coming up here. Lord. Hey, y'all man, see it. That was yeah, that was definitely interesting. That was very, very interesting. Well, I'd have been one of That's the, a, the better yeah. guests. I mean, on some sit on the couch and let us know what y'all think in the comments. That That's what we good. want. All right, yeah. appreciate y'all, Chef. You already know, Ill, Sir Nick. You already know, man. Nikon. Yes.
sir. <laughs>